Hey there players, how's it going? Today I've got my brand new Nintendo Switch, it just came out today, I ended up getting the neon coloured one, so I thought I'd unbox it and show you what you get. Now first of all, the first thing you'll notice is, the box is really freaking small, it reminds me kind of of the old NES or SNES boxes, but it's actually smaller than those too. And I've also got the, the new Zelda game to check out, so let's check it out, eh? Alright, so... Ooh, little tab here you got to take out. Here we go. Ooh, it's got how you set it up on the side. Plug it in, set it up. Oh, how sweet does that look? Wow, the controllers are quite bright. That is a crazy coloured pink. Oh, I'm not sure if it's showing up on the camera that crazy, but in real life it looks pretty damn crazy. Cool. And this is the actual screen. Wow, it's actually smaller than I thought. Quite heavy, not too bad though. Anyway, let's take the screen out. I'll we'll have to start clicking this stuff together. They're tiny little controllers. It's a good size though. All right, now we've got another layer. There we go, we've got a little important information. I'll read that, never. Um, we've got a HDMI cable. This is our AC adapter charger. We'll be using that a lot. Okay, now this is the top or bottom, well, top of the joystick, and you put them on, and you then you get some shoulder, shoulder buttons. And I think it will feel better. Check it out. It goes together like that. All right, woohoo! This is pretty fun. So this is where the two joysticks slide into it. Let's take this all out so we can check it out. They slide into here, so you get your big full-size style joystick. I'll have to try out all the different options shortly. There's another top. And here is the docking station. And that looks like the works. That is what you get. All right, let's get rid of this big box. Well, little box, I should say. Okay, so let's see how this all clicks together, eh? So, can I do it one handed? Yes, Ooh, makes that nice click noise. Let me get into this pink one. There we go, so that's what the full size joystick looks like. It is actually really light. Feels nice to touch. You know, it probably won't be quite as cool as my Xbox joystick, which is my favorite joystick, but it is really cool, and I didn't really have a joystick like this on the Wii, so already I'm off to a good start. Now, I'm not sure how you eject these things. So many buttons. Okay, right, let's check out this stand. There we go. Someone online was complaining that they couldn't stand it like that. Which is a bit silly if you ask me, because you want to sit your screen in there. So this is the whole kind of brains of the system in the screen. Jeez, I need to buy myself a screen protector. So, ooh, there's a little kickstand at the back. That comes out. All right, let's slide her in to the machine. Oop, did I put it in the right way? Yes, I think I did. All right, well, we've chucked her in. So now all I need to do is add a bit of power, add the HDMI, and we should be ready for gaming. Okay, I'll just show you this other thing if I can work out how to dismantle this joystick. Alright, there are little buttons here. Uh, yep. So to pull these apart, there's a little button right there. You push it in. And it slides out. Whoop. So we can also chuck these on the screen. And 
this is what it looks like when you're in portable mode that is pretty fun actually that is cool and as a portable machine it's a massive screen like it's a lot bigger than the say PlayStation Vita or the 3DS and once again I think we just push those little buttons on the back to pull it apart and we can add this and this is this would be cool for uh, two player mode and that a little slider on there oh I missed let's, let's see if it's well designed I should be able to do it with a one hand I reckon it's hard though get on there Alright, maybe I won't get it all one-handed. Alright, so I had to start that off with two hands. So if you're a one-handed person, you probably have more skills than me and you probably could be able to do it, but I found it quite hard. And that should be a full joystick with the top. Now we've got a couple of shoulder buttons. That's quite good really, because you've got two of those. So you can, straight off the bat, you can play two player games with your mates. How cool is that? And the other thing is... You can play them. Oh, I'm gonna... Yeah, and the other, other cool thing is you can just always pull out your kickstand here. How do you pull your kickstand out? Yeah, you just pull it out like that, and then you can play it while you're camping or whatever. Just prop it up like that. I'm really looking forward to doing that with my mates. Well, anyway, I better set it up so I can play some Zelda. Oh, let's check out what you get in Zelda. I don't think it's going to be much. Here's the game. Kind of about the same size as a PSP game. Maybe slightly wider. Ooh, we got a, we got a map. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Bonus. And this is what the actual games look like. So they're actually like little SD cards. And I've heard they don't taste too good, so don't lick them. <laughs> Anyway, I want to play Zelda, so I'm going to set it up and check out my Zelda playthrough soon, y'all. Bye.